I want to give you a little tip on the flight of a bird. This is something I learned years ago when we were working Sleeping Beauty at the Disney Studio. So let me just get a little, a little bird drawing going here. And I'm going to play him from the side so you can... Oh, I'm going to play him from the side so that... If that's his little body and his tail. So there's the bird right there. Let's say that his wings were extended up like this, so they're at the high point in animating the bird. Here's, of course, is his little legs. I'm going to put this bird with a little happy expression on his face. There we go. So there's the wings up. If I want to draw the bird now where uh, his wings come down, I know the rhythm already, but I'm going to say, Here's the bird's face again. Where the wings come down, it's working against um, the air. So these wings right here are going to sort of push down, but watch this. It's like this. So it's a slow out of this position. So the wings are, this is their highest point or the extreme. This right here is a slow out and notice this curve on both sides where the wings are there. Now you're going to think somehow that your next drawing is going to be where the wings are right in here, but you'd be wrong. So let's go, let's go to the next drawing. The bird, does the fun part, is drawing the head over again. There's the little body. The bird's next position where the rings would be is down there. So it's wings up, slow out, wings down. The next position for your bird <clears throat> is where the wings are on their way back up. Now it's going to be a slow out of this position. So I'm going to get to uh, the little face again. And here's the body. This is the one that I've always thought was awkward. Right in here in the wing, at this point, it's like there's a little joint. There's a joint right there, and this joint moves up. And when it does, the bird will go like this. This is drawing that probably is the most awkward to draw, but it represents sort of a lift. So you can see from that to this gentle little lift, and your next drawing will be back into this. So it's wings at full height, slow out on the way down, extreme position on the way down, slow out on the way back up. And that right there is the flight of a bird in just a little four drawing cycle. Usually what you'll do is you'll shoot this, you'll shoot this on twos. Two frames, two frames, two frames, two frames. That means in eight frames, this little bird has started his way back eight, nine, ten. On ten frames, he'll be back here once again. So there's a little flight of a bird for you to just study and look at just a little bit. It's easy as pie if you ever have to do um, a flight on, uh, on a little bird. However, when it gets into the bigger birds, like the eagle and the vulture and all those kinds, the condors, their wings are much more elegant and it's slower in the way that you express it. But you have up, this, slow out, down, slow out, up. Anyway, there you go. Thanks a lot.